we know who's here because you're the real deal. Who recognize that we veterans, yeah, of course, we've got struggles, but we've got strengths. We have experiences, a global experience. Many of us have deployed into harm's way, and if we haven't deployed, we've been ready to raise our hand and said, here I am, send me, and we have all work as part of a team. We know what values-based leadership is all about. You know, for years, word around my neck, the Army dog tag, leadership, it's about loyalty, duty, respect, selfless service, honor, integrity, and personal courage. It's about mission first. It's about never quit, never accept defeat. And my personal favorite, never leave a fallen comrade. That's as true in the streets and the boardrooms and the parks and the subways of New York City as it, as it is in the battlefields and the staging areas of Iraq, Afghanistan, and any of the places where America's best are serving on our behalf. You know, one of the things I did today, some of you know that on my email this last year, I had a quote from uh, Churchill who said, never, 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 never give up, never, never, never give up. And so today I thought, you know, it's time, like, at the changing of the year, let me think of something else. What do I want to put for this next year? And I thought, well, let's check out what old General Sophocles had to say 2,500 years ago. And I found the perfect quote that fits where I am right now and where I want to help lead and galvanize our partnerships in our city. Sophocles put it this way very simply, he said, there is no success without hardship. Okay? There is no success without hardship. And this last year has been full of high moments, it's been full of tough moments, it's been full of hardship, because change is always hard, even positive change, sometimes especially positive change. The future is full of partnerships. It's full of reaching out and connecting. It's not about competition. It's about reaching into places we've never been before, because guess what? Veterans are everywhere. We've got an entire 220,000 veterans add their family members here in New York City. You're talking half a million folks. The great thing is, here in New York, you can find whatever it is you're dreaming to do or to be. And you know, when it comes to veterans, we're always going to find a way to serve others, maybe in a different uniform. But we're also going to reach out and we're going to, we're going to reintegrate not only within ourselves, within our community, but also with partnerships across the vibrant sectors of New York City. This, the greatest city in the world. So let me just end by uh, saying at this point that um, take vitamins. <laughs> I ain't seen nothing yet. Thanks so much.